Well, right then, folks, I just thought I'd just do a quick little live video just to test my new camera out. See what it looks like indoors. It never tends to look that good under these fluorescent lights. So I'll just do a little five-minute video. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, got a few people watching already, which is a bit bonkers. <laughs> I hope my camera doesn't fall in the water bucket, my phone. I'm only making some of these little, we call them olive bowls. Just dead simple little bowls. Really just to see how this video looks. My new camera if it's worth recording on my, on my phone sorry rather than my camera so. Got a few comments up hello from Russia hey -o. right I need to pop these somewhere don't I That. Put these on here. A bit chaotic, this really. But... Hello from Leeds. Hey, <laughs> oh, that's close. Hello from the USA. Can't believe I'm getting views. It quarter past three on a Saturday afternoon, Manchester. <laughs> Hello, where do you buy your clay? We get all ours from Stoke-on-Trent. It's called the Potteries. It's where the pottery industry originated in England. And it's still where it's all mainly dug from. Tell me what is the machine? It's absolutely ancient. I wouldn't have a clue what make it is. It's not got any serial numbers on it. It's it's just an absolutely ancient old thing. It's not very technical like a lot of the ones today, but it does its job. From India. I've been a potter for two years now, your YouTube taught me a lot, thank you, great, no props. That's what we're there for, if anyone can get a bit of help from what I'm doing, I'm not saying I'm there to teach you, but if it helps, then all good. From Bangladesh, I think you've never heard of this, that country, oh yeah, I've heard of Bangladesh, we've got a Bangladesh restaurant in the village, great food. your voice and hair I don't. Having a bad hair day today. Looks like I've just been dragged backwards through a hedge. From Norway. I assume you sell pottery which is your top selling product actually these. We sell loads of these because they're dirt cheap. They have a, they have a use, of, I suppose, just little serving dishes or actually we call them nut or olive bowls. So. And they are idiot proof to make once you get the hang of it. So. Try to look at your questions and do this at the same time. Is it hard? 
not when you're not, I do it, no, but it is like anything when you when you're learning, it's difficult, but once you get practice in the hang of it, it's it's easy enough. And you make the bars. I haven't got any clay, hang on there. I'm just finishing off the little bits of clay I've got there. Try. In fact, I'm going to make. I'll try and make a big vase. See if it. Just to finish off. See if it'll fit on the screen. I'm not sure if it will or not. Bars. I'll try and I don't, I'm not sure I'm trying to look out I don't think it'll fit on because if I do make one it's going to be a big one I'll try and alter the camera I've got, I'll have to go and get another piece of clay a big ball of clay I'll just put these out of the way if you just give me two minutes bat on to start with. This could be risky doing one of these big ones live. That's a duff bat that one. It's about the only pots I ever mess up now and again. <laughs> so you could have it, you could be it could be a first, the first flop on YouTube for me. So I'll just I need a bit more water, I need to get my camera sorted out. So if I put that there, how much height can I get now? Might fit in, we'll see, I'll just go and get a piece of clay anyway. Got a bigger piece now. Six pound ball of clay. I'll just put a bit more water in. So this is where you could see it go all wrong. But we'll try not to. Centre the big piece up like this by coning it up and then pushing it down. So that's that. Is that ten or twelve? It's actually six pound a clear this. Big one. Well, it's, it's about as big as I can do on my wheel because the wheel's slowest speed's too fast to make huge pieces, but it's big enough anyway. So I'll just get a bit of this thick stuff up from the bottom. Now I need to sort of collar it in make it narrower so it doesn't get too wide so I just keep squeezing it in like that and from the bottom
Right, we'll go for the first knuckle lift, as always, which is that knuckle in there against my hand inside, and then pull it up. See me <laughs> stomach hanging out. Can you please speak my name? Diva Nariesh Sat Diva. I can't see from there, my eyes are the best anyway. <laughs> so that's my wheel now, slowed down as slow as it'll go. So as you can see, it's still quite fast. I'm limited to the size. So I'll collar it in again, I'll do one more lift. To get a little bit more of this thick stuff up. Might go a little bit wobbly. As you can see there, because it's getting a bit thin. But I can sort that out later. Hopefully. Let's try and straighten this bit out just by pushing it from the inside out. Could be a disaster this one, because I've not thrown one of these big ones for a while. at the bottom for some reason. Right. Try and add a bit of shape to it now. This one, I'm afraid, flares a little bit too soft for making big stuff, but we'll get something out of it. shop now. Oh I'll just shape it from the inside out now. Get a bit of a wider shoulder on it. It's a bit thick at the bottom, but I can trim all that off tomorrow. I 
up. So I can get this bit a lot narrower tomorrow when I turn it, trim it. So it should have a nicer shape. So I'll just mop all the water out. Fifteen minutes. I think that'll be about it. So I'll mop this out, clean my hands, turn it off. I don't. I'll probably have some buttons to press. <laughs> so I'm not doing a live video for about a year. So that's that. Like I said, all this will be nicely. I'll make it a lot nicer shape tomorrow when it's dry, and I can trim it. First big vase live without making a mess, so that's a bonus. So anyway, that's about it I think folks, 16 and a half minutes. It's probably a button I have to press so it'll stay on as a video on my channel, so I will say farewell and I'll do it again if it's been a success. I don't know what I'm supposed to do now. What am I supposed to do? Press X, press that, no, what's that mean, no, chat, no, <laughs> I don't know what to do, it doesn't tell you, press X, are you sure that you want to stop streaming, 